My name's Victoria Cross, and I want to be your Ward 4 Councillor. Thanks to the Windsor Star for taking the time to do this. As Don said, or I overheard him say just now, democracy rocks and no one ever said it was easy. We've got a lot of choices facing Windsor. I live in the heart of this ward, in the home my husband's parents bought in 1947. Life in Windsor was much simpler then. It's not like the old days. Now, employment is precarious. Jobs to support a family are hard to find. And so is our ability to relate well to government at all levels. We are in a different world. What I bring to the council table are three major things. First, I bring a useful education. I have two degrees from the University of Windsor and a master's degree in international human rights law from the University of London in England. That means I studied how the European Union works and I came home to practice law. I taught at the university too. Constitutional law, environmental law for engineers, labor law and policy. I'm following the federal government negotiations on the Canadian-European trade agreement. This treaty will have a direct impact on Windsor, on Windsor families, and jobs for Windsor people, just as the North American Free Trade Agreement did, and the end to the auto pact killed jobs here. When it comes to dealing with issues around international employers, I have a worldview as well as a local one. I know about international agreements and world economic and social realities, and zoning and sewers and taxes too. Good jobs matter here in Windsor, and I will fight for them. Second, I have a lifetime of experience here, 30 years of work in this community, and the wisdom learned from working with all levels of government, sometimes on the inside. I advocate for people, for our community, and of course, I've been volunteering here for years. Right now, I sit on the Handy Transit Board, which gives me a special eye on transportation in this city. I also sit on the Friends of Ojibwe Park Board, and with many others, was there to stop that big box store. Most recently, I have appeared at Council on issues regarding tax fairness. It's time we have a fair tax commission in Windsor to examine how we assess, assign, and collect taxes. It isn't enough to shout slogans. What we have to do is work from shared knowledge about how our tax system works. We need to make decisions based on that knowledge together. This, of course, goes along with re-establishing the internal Auditor General position with free reign to, to conduct wide scope analysis of how our money's been spent. We need audits of every major project and arm's length energy, uh, excuse me, we need, we need serious analysis of every major project and particularly NWIN. Third, the rubber hits the road in our neighborhoods. Let's make our sure our neighborhoods are a place where young people and families have fair taxes, good housing, affordable hydro, water. We must focus on good roads, proper sewers, streets that are well lit and safe, plenty of green space, access to jobs, and thriving arts, entertainment, and shopping districts. Finally, I want to say that I'm here for all the people of this ward. We come to Windsor from all over this world to dig in for fair, safe communities where we can raise our families. I will work to represent this ward and all the people in it with the same strong-minded determination we have come to respect from the Ward 4 representative. My name is Victoria Cross. 
and I ask for your vote on October 27th.